So you're trying to get cinematic lighting for your YouTube videos or whatever else you're filming for, short film, TikTok, Instagram, whatever. And you want it to look good, cinematic, and you want it to look natural. And indoors, it's it can be very difficult to get a natural look whenever there's not a whole lot of light to deal with. And if you don't have a whole lot of money to get a whole bunch of special lights to make it look cinematic, then it can be pretty difficult. The technique I'm about to tell you about is called motivated light. Basically what motivated light means is you have a light source in the same direction as a light that's already natural and then you have to match the color of that light or the warmth of that light to make it seem to the viewer that it's actually coming from a light that is natural. So it may sound hard and a lot of people think that it is not super easy, but as long as you understand a few things, it makes everything way easier. Basically, well, all you need to understand is the light warmth then the direction of light and that's pretty much it. That's pretty much all you need to get this look. And pretty much all movies do this. If you're watching a movie, it looks like the light is just coming from a lamp or a TV or something like that and then it's doing an establishing shot with that and then it zooms in on the person's face. Pretty much every single time you see that happen, when they zoom in on the person's face, it's gonna be a motivated light, not the light coming from the actual TV or whatever. But big movie studios have a really, really big budget. So I'm gonna show you how you can get it done with a uh, really low budget. Starting with the light, it's about 50 bucks for the light. Um, you can find a bunch on Amazon for cheaper or more expensive, but just know you're getting what you paid for. Get as much as you can afford for the light itself. Um, having a tripod for a light is relatively inexpensive. I haven't looked it up in a while, but it's about $20 for a tripod light. And what, by, what I mean by tripod light is it's just a, a lightweight one, you know, just don't put your camera on it. Just uh, it's just meant for stuff like a little lightweight thing. You're gonna probably be spending about 70 bucks-ish, more or less, depending on which one you go for. So now that you know what motivated light is, I have three tips that'll help you get a more cinematic look with using the motivated light. The first one being create shadow and light pockets. So you want there to be the light, and then you want there to be some darkness, and then you want there to be some you know contrast between the two tip number two is kind of intertwined with this the first one now you want some practical lights in the background and that'll help you make the shadow and light pockets more contrasty the third tip is color grading and i have a video on color grading already video is right here and i will see you in that video